Minions, welcome! I am the Overlord, and this is Pokemon Star Platinum. And let us continue down this path, Route 213, the beach. This is W213, the beach. Kind of sounds like a radio station. So a bunch of these fishermen people are probably going to fish, but also... Pokey battle? Oh, I guess not. I guess not. We had Rock Smash, we could smash all these rocks. We don't need to smash the rocks. Let rocks be rocks. And I startled this guy, so now he wants vengeance. By Pokemon. And it's a Carvana. Appropriate for a fisherman. Dark water type, it's going to go down to a silver wind. And that'll be quite nice for us. Critical hit too, just to just to show a moose boss. Things like, nope. I'm not fish bait. I will destroy you. Wants to learn cross poison, that is great, because its attack is way higher than its special attack. And U turn's pretty powerful, but you have to switch out when you use it, so that's unfortunate. So this is just straight up way better than Sludge. Join the Cross Poison crew. It's Cherubi. We'll keep battling, because that's a great way to test our Cross Poison. Cherubi brings out the sun. Cross Poison, and it's done. Boom. Rhyming already. Only, only about a minute or so in. It's nice. It's appropriate. A sunny day at the beach. Weavile. Dark. Ice type. So we should be able to take it out with a silver wind. And usually they're super quick too, but I guess the stats are sort of randomized, so maybe not. Sting got the boost off of that. That's great. Unfortunately, it's going to fake tears. Okay, so that lowers special defense, not special attack. So yeah, we're in a great position here. Going to wipe out this Weavile, and that will be that. Sting gains a bunch, Queen gains a bunch. And that guy just got owned. Dr. Footsteps House. Footprints reveal all. Alright, crazy. It's quite easy for me to read. Your Skorupi, it's footprints. I will determine how it feels about you. It doesn't like me very much. You know what? Screw you, Duck. You're a quack. I'm suing you for malpractice. Sting loves me. Because I make her strong and powerful. Stronger than all the other Skorupis out there. And I shall demonstrate through this next battle. Also, I'm going to keep training up Sting for a while, because... It has to evolve soon. Maybe 36? Not 100% sure, but... Soon. And here we learned that... Poison is not that great against Ghost. So maybe Bug! You turn! Excellent. Critical hit. Don't think we needed it, but I'll take it. And Effect Spore made Sting fall asleep, which is kind of annoying. At least it's the end of the battle, so we can just give it the old awakening. I think we have some of those. Yes. Sting Awakening. <laughs> Instead of Spring Awakening, the musical. There's a reference for you. Ugh. I want you item, but I cannot get you. 
The wall is very rocky. How will we get up here? How? I don't know, but will we catch a new Pokemon? Let's see our Route 213 Pokemon here. Ooh, an Onix, a rock type. We could definitely use... Definitely use a rock type of sorts. Let's go ahead and give it the old cross poison. It won't do that much, but maybe it'll poison it. Ah, uh, it's going to use spikes. That's annoying. So if I switch out... Whoever switches in will take damage. It's going to use hypnosis. Alright, this Onyx is, is up to something. And Sting goes back to sleep. It's a shame. It's a shame. Let's bring Planto out. Planto can deal with it. I think what I'm going to do is slap a Leech Seed on there, start draining Onyx's health, and then throw Pokeballs until... Well, until either it dies or we catch it. Oh, and it's going to use Dig. Well, that's certainly interesting. And we're going to top off Planta's health. Well, let's... I don't know what to do. I don't think we can throw a Pokeball at it. Let's confirm. No good. It's impossible to aim at the Pokemon that's not in sight. It's kind of funny, though. And it makes sense, but... Gonna have to always delete each seed. Can you dig it? <laughs> yes, we can. So we know three of its moves. It would be quite interesting to learn of the fourth. But we will have to get past that first. Great ball coming out. How great is it? No bamboozle. Yes! All right. Onyx was caught. It burrows through the ground at a speed of 50 miles per hour while feeding on large boulders. Whew! Also, it's in pretty good shape. It stands over 28 feet tall, and it's only 463 pounds, and it's made of rock. That's, that's not too bad. Definitely all muscle on that onyx. White snake? Because he onyx is kind of a snake. He's a rock snake. White Snake. So there you go. There's your band reference for the episode. Ogoth Berry. I don't think these berries actually are very good, so... Let's get Sting back up to, back up to speed here. Little Awakening. Pow. Let's give it a berry. Since it apparently hates us! We'll use a few orine berries. Get it up to 81. The equivalent of a potion. That's fine. And then from here, it looks like it's just tall grass. Let's go ahead and take a quick peek. Yep. Footprints are left in the sand when you walk on the beach. Do you know about the Battle Frontier? Yeah, I know. I know it. It's a bunch of stuff that we don't care about. Because that's after we beat the Elite Four. Seen the Great Mark. Wait, have we been to this place before? Is this Pistoria City? No, this is new. Out of there! Let me see if you're worthy of a scarf. Yeah, I don't care about your scarf. Darn contests and stuff. The Parichisu squirrel, squirrel face. Q 
cute electric type. You have an umbrella for a head. You're wearing an umbrella like a hat. Hey, thanks for making me smile. Here's some white fluff. Uh, thanks. I believe it's called a cotton ball. Yo, look at me, I'm a Pokemon, ha! Huh? And yet I travel alone. The Great Marsh. Okay, so you're a nerd. Package arrived from... Oh, explosives! Maybe we should let actual authorities deal with that. And instead, after a quick heal... Turns out we wasted those berries, but that's fine. It was a treat. It was a special treat. Talk to this guy. And this guy wants to battle in a hospital. In a hospital for Pokemon. It's just like, hey, let's battle! Hoo <laughs> hoo! This guy is ridiculously irresponsible. This is a hospital, dude. Sick Pokemon are treated there for their injuries, which I guess is appropriate for you because you just got wrecked. But now I'm going to have to heal back up. Now let's check out the Pokemon we caught. Just to see, maybe, ooh, maybe they have items and stuff too. Pet shop. Good stuff. Somewhat of a clown. Jolly in nature. That's not quite like the, the pet shop in JoJo. But that's okay. Raises evasion in a hailstorm with snow cloak. Mm, about average stats. Nothing too crazy. Extreme speed. Nice. Great move. Always hits first. Feather Dance, good to lower the attack of something a lot, and then Growth and Sonic Boom, which aren't fantastic. There's that, and then White Snake. Rock Ground, somewhat of a clown. Rough Skin, inflicts damage to foe on contact, which is amazing. Has pretty bad attack, pretty good special attack. Great HP. Uh, but pretty bad stats otherwise. Who knows? Hypnosis, Power Gem, Spikes and Digs. Power Gem's a great move for it since it has special attacks. And the rest of these are just kind of weird. So yeah, White Snake. He's alright. He's alright. Definitely, I think we have a Steel Coat too. So we can get it to evolve somehow. The randomizer I have allows it to evolve without training, but I don't know how that works. Oh, and maybe I don't have a steel coat. Well, that's the item we probably need, and then I guess just level it up while it's holding it? It's a fun mystery for another day. So we'll check out that great marsh once we're done exploring the city. Oh, there's Jim. Pistoria. Okay, so this is Pistoria. I bet he doesn't use water attacks at all, because it's a randomizer. So you're wrong. Something about the ecosystem... There's a Psyduck. Hi, Duck. The Psyduck. It's the Marsh City. And the Siri... Siri. And the Siri without berries. The city without berries, because I'm picking them all, and not replanting them, haha! -ha. Take that, activists, or something, I don't know. Can't you surf until we beat this clown. And he's standing smack dab in the middle of town. Okay, y'all gotta clean up. Ooh, heart scales. This is the move tutor, then. Still gotta clean up the books on your floor. Come on, put it on a shelf or in a box or something. There's the Pokemon Mansion. Great Marsh stuff. It's this way, this is out of town. This is Route 212, okay. 
And it's raining. Good to know. Seems like it rains a lot. Ooh, a babiri berry. Good berry. Maybe. Maybe it's a pointless berry. I'm going to pretend like it does something really good. While we sneak in here and see what's... But there's an item on the ground or something. I don't know. No? No item? Nope. Doesn't seem like there's any item. Just a random place right there. Mysterious. There's a Clefairy. Hey, Clefairy. I'll give you a Macho Brace if you catch Combies. But I don't want to catch Combies. It's not going to happen. Not at all. I mean, it could happen, but it won't. Let's check out the gym. Oh no. Oh, snapperoonies. It's spaz. Buffing up your Pokemon. We were talking about this last episode. We knew the surprise trainer battle was, with our rival was coming. This is Staravia. That could be scary because Star Raptor, like, owned us. Also, this is a terrible matchup. Oh, jeez. Alright, well, I was caught unprepared, and clearly his team is pretty swole. It knows Brave Bird. That's a very powerful attack. Uh, whew. Okay, so I'm gonna fly. Get out of here. Fly up high. It's gonna use Aero Blast. It'll miss. Hopefully, this will take it out in one shot. It did not do anything of the sort. Okay, so that's an Aero Blast. I think we're just gonna... Use some items. How about a Moo Moo Milk? On Dio. And if it Brave Birds and we can fly again, we'll just do what we did before. It's gonna use Aero Blast, which is unfortunate. So it's not gonna take any extra damage from the recoil. Oops. Don't need to go to the bag quite yet. And we will fly... We could have toxic it. But it's hoping we would take it out. Let's try the Chatter to see if the Chatter does a lot more damage to it. Maybe it has bad special defense. Okay, it did enough to take it out. Which is good enough for me. For right now. Yeah, it's good. Queen grows to level 29, which is good. Queen might have to jump into this fight soon. <sighs> Great attack, though, but... Eww. Charizard. Okay, this, so this is... This is tough, because Queen's water moves are special attack, and Queen does not have a good special attack stat at all. Planto is countered by it. Hot Wings is countered by it because it's part flying. Sting is countered by it because Sting's still bug type. So it's got to be Lousy D. Lousy D going in with the Psycho Cut. Ooh, it's going to be rough though. Level 36. It's going to use Aero Blast. Wow, they all like Aero Blast. Lousy D is going to take a little more than half damage that... Oh, and barely does anything to it. Oh, boy. Whew. This is get, getting a little anxious here. Psycho Cut's not going to do any good. Lousy D's likely going to faint before getting a second attack in. Unless we have some battle items. Guard spec, fluffy tail, accuracy, attack. No. There's no way to increase its special defense. And it's going to use Aero Blast, which. Is, ooh, that's. That's just rough. Alright, well. 
Lousy D is not going to get an, an attack in. Lousy D will just die. So let's take this opportunity to heal Dio back up. Oh, Magma Storm. Okay, so it used something different. So maybe we can use a Swift? No. No, it was just, it was just teasing me. And that's Lousy D. Lousy D is dead. Oh, that is not great. That is not great at all. I think we gotta go back to Dio. Dio's our only choice, our only hope. So let's do a Toxic, and then we'll just try to stall for time by using Fly. It's gonna use Sacred Fire. Luckily that misses, because it probably would have burnt Dio. And that would have been bad news for all of us. So it's going to keep trying to use Sacred Fire. It knows all of the crazy powerful attacks. Toxic's going to work on it. Little by little. Hits with the Sacred Fire this time. Come on, Dio. Okay, so... If we fly, we should be okay. Let's do it. Let's fly. And it gets taken down. So is Dio still stuck in the air then? What's going to happen here? Crocodile. Yes, we will switch. We will switch to Planto. Huh. I guess we just called it back from midair. Alright. Jeez. If Queen was in fighting shape, we would have would we would have been able to, to have that pretty easily, but I think Queen would have gotten wrecked. Let's start out with Bullet Seed, see what happens. If it does some damage to us, then we'll make that back up with Giga Drain. But if this hits three times, we won't have to worry about that. It only hits twice, sure. But Crocodile is not scary at all. So we got this. Just in case there's something super spooky, I'm going to heal Dio back up with another super potion. It's going to splash. Splash. Which, I don't know why it has that move besides the fact that it's a randomizer, but that's fine. A free turn, some healing for me, that's great. Don't even have to use a Giga Drain. I'm going to eat my Black Sludge. And go back up to full HP. Thanks to Planto. It's going to use Trickerita. All right, so he knows he has basically starter Pokemon, and with that we can bring out Hot Wings. Oh boy! Okay, so Charizard was the strongest. Good to know. We want to have a counter to Charizard. So Chikorita you Snatch, which means it would steal the effects of stat-ups, but I didn't use a stat-up move, I used a regular attack move, so it got roasted. What just happened? Are you telling me I lost? Huh, maybe you did get better since last time. Oh, that was a... That was a rough fight. We only lost one, but we could have lost more. That Charizard is not to be hecked with. Alright, Lousy D. You did your country proud. Take the amulet coin, and that starts the third row of graveyard. Not a great f feeling, but what can you do? 
So once Sting evolves, it won't be as big of a deal because he won't be weak to fire and flying like everything else on my team. <laughs> so let's see, weak to ice, weak to ice, I think. Flying, flying weakness, flying, hmm. It's like White Snake shares a lot of weaknesses with a lot of other people, but the resistance I think is what we need. So we're gonna we're gonna roll with White Snake. Yeah, White Snake. Yeah, we only have one experience share. I guess it's time. I guess it's time to do some power leveling. Because we just got trashed. Well, we didn't get trashed, but it was a, it was a rough battle. Lousy D got trashed, and that Charizard was level thirty six, which was way stronger than even Sting that we've been kind of training up. So that was a doozy of an episode. Didn't even get to see the lake because it was blocked off by people, but we managed to survive the impending surprise rival fight and we're in prime position to go and snag ourselves another gym badge, five out of eight, during the next episode. I certainly hope you had a good time watching this. I had a good time making it. And if you'd like to support me in my quest to make more videos like this, please like and subscribe. And go ahead and click the notification bell too. It would really help me if you would share this around and help me grow viral. Whoa! Uh, but, you know, you do you. And that's about all I have for this episode, so go now, my minions! Be free! Mwahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahah